Top 10 Redis Interview Questions and Answers for Fresh and Experienced Candidates. 1. What is Redis? Redis is an advanced key value data store and cache. It has is also referred to as a data structure server as such the keys not only contain strings but also hashes, sets, lists, and sorted sets. Companies using Redis include Stack Overflow Up, Twitter, GitHub, etc. 2. Explain the replication feature of Redis. Redis supports simple master-to-slave replication. When a relationship is established, data from the master is transferred to the slave. Once this is done, all changes to the master replicate to the slave. 3. Which PHP module can be used with Redis? In PHP module, PRedis is more preferable than Reded PHP binding or resident. 4. What is the difference between memcached and Redis? Redis Redis also does cache information but has got additional features like persistence and replication Redis does not support the functionality of LRU least recently used eviction of values in Redis you can set a timeout on everything when memory is full it will look at three random keys and deletes the one which is closest to expiry Redis does not support CAS check and set it is useful for maintaining cache consistency Redis has got stronger data structures it can handle strings binary safe strings list of binary safe strings sorted lists etc Redis had a maximum of 2 gigabytes key length Redis is single threaded memcached memcached only cache information memcached supports the functionality of LRU least recently used eviction of values in memcached when they overflow memory the one you have not used recently LRU least recently used will get deleted memcached supports CAS check and set in memcached you have to serialize the objects or arrays in order to save them and to read them back you have to unserialize them Memcached had a maximum of 250 bytes length. Memcached is a multi-threaded. 5. What are the advantages of using Redis? Advantage of using Redis are it provides high speed. It supports a server side locking. It has got lots of client lib. It has got command level atomic operation. TX operation. 6. What are the limitations of Redis? It is single threaded it has got limited client support for consistent hashing it has significant overhead for persistence it is not deployed widely. Seven list out the operation keys of Redis. Operation keys of Redis include type key TTL key keys pattern expire key seconds EXPIR EAT key timestamp exists key del key. Eight, does Redis give speed and durability both? No, Redis purposely compromises the durability to enhance the speed. In Redis, in the event of system failure or crash, Redis writes to disk but may fall behind and lose the data which is not stored. Nine, how can you improve the durability in Redis? To improve the durability of Redis, append only file can be configured by using FSYNC data on disk. FSYNC, every time a new command is added to the append log file. It is safe but very slow FYSNC, one time every second, it is fast, but you may lose one second of data if system fails never FSYNC, it is an unsafe method. And your data is in hand of operating system. 10. Mention what are the things you have to take care of while using Redis. While using Redis one must take care of select a consistent method to name and prefix your keys. Manage your namespace create a registry of key prefixes that maps each of your internal documents for that application which own them for every class you put through into your Redis. Infrastructure. Design, implement and test the mechanisms for garbage collection or data migration to archival storage design. Implement and test a sharding library before you have invested much into your application deployment and make sure that you keep a registry of shards replicated on each server separate all your KB. Storing related operations into your own library, API or service.